Hi, this is Rafiq Suleiman, and you are watching Cloud Simplified. Hi, everyone, and welcome to this new series, AWS Cloud Practitioner Express. In this new series, we'll be going through the most famous cloud computing certificate in the market right now, which is the Cloud Practitioner. As always, we'll try to simplify the concepts and services. We'll be doing some hands-on, as well as doing some exam practice questions to be sure that you are ready and very well prepared to go and take and pass the exam. I hope you are excited with this. Let's get started. So we're going to start with the first part. And in the first part, we'll be talking about the different cloud computing deployment models. And let's start with the first one. The first one is where we call it on-premise. And also another name of the on-premise is what we call private cloud. And in the private cloud, this means that you have your physical data center and you have all your applications, all your workloads are running from the physical resources inside this data center. And then with the time organizations, they realize the benefits of cloud. And that's why in order for them to migrate, they cannot migrate just in one shot. And that's why the second model is what we call the hybrid model. And in the hybrid model, this is where I have my physical on-premise data center. And then I migrated some other applications on the public cloud. So right now I'm running in a hybrid mode. Hybrid mode means some applications and workloads are running on-premise, but I migrated other applications and workloads also on the public cloud. And please pay attention in something here. Some organizations, they have their cloud strategy as hybrid. Hybrid means they don't want to completely rely on the physical data centers, and also they don't want to completely rely on the public cloud. So they want to be working as a hybrid mode. So this might be one option. The other option, I am working in hybrid mode because I am in the middle of my migration. So usually I divide my applications and workloads into migration waves, and then I migrate part by part. And then if you're doing migration, then you will be ending up after migrating all your applications and workloads, you will end up into what we call the cloud or another term called the public cloud. And public cloud means I have now all my applications, all of my workloads completely running on the public cloud and I decommissioned completely my data center. So one scenario that can let me end up in the public cloud by migrating from the physical on-premise to the public cloud, that's one scenario. Another scenario maybe, you have some organizations that they have been born on the cloud, which means they started already from the cloud. They started from scratch on the cloud. They didn't have a physical data center. And famous organizations like Netflix, like Airbnb, like Uber, these famous organizations, they started born on the cloud with a public cloud deployment model. So these are the three options. Again, let me quickly recap. The first option, is the on-premise or the private cloud where you have everything inside your physical data center. And then the second model is what we call the hybrid. And this is where you have some applications running on-premise, some other applications running in the public cloud. And the third one, it's called the public cloud. This is where you have all your applications and workloads running on your public cloud provider. So I hope the concept is now clear with this. Thank you so much and see you in the next video.